Hello boys and girls, um, I'm the Jack and Ori cabbie, uh, just going to tell you some stories, funny, interesting stories from the back of the cab. The idea is to hopefully get um, a publisher or maybe uh, a literary agent interested in um, kind of getting us a book deal for, for the reason of um, giving some money to Lee Rigby's son. Um, which that young boy, he needs a little bit of a start in life. So the first um, story I'd like to tell you is I picked a fellow up in a Sloan Square and he wanted the south side of Wandsworth Bridge. Would I stop in the Esso Garage um, in the King's Road to allow him to get some cash, which uh, no different than anyone else. I prefer money. Um... So he's at the cash point, and he's doing that, tapping all his pockets, and I thought to myself, this don't look good, does it? So he's come back, and he says, I think I've left my cash card beyond the, the bar in the botanist. Can we go back there? Yeah, all right then. So he's on the phone to the botanist, but he's being really, really rude. He's effing and jeffing. And I said to him, look, if you spoke to me like that, and I had your card, I'd doubt if I'd give it back to you. So when you go in there, be a little bit humble. So he's come out, he says, look, they've not got my card. I can't pay for my fare with card or cash. And I've got to get home because I've got a babysitter looking after my children. I said to him, well, if I'm not going to get paid, another 20 minutes is not going to make a lot of difference, is it? Jump in. So on the way there, he says to me, would I mind... Um, giving him my address so he can post me a check. Now, this made me laugh. Um, I He said to me, please don't laugh at me because I'm a millionaire. So I laughed again. When we got to the south side of Wandsworth Bridge, there's £32 on the metre. Two days later, I got a check and a nice letter thanking me for my kindness from a chap called Mark. Move on. A year, a year and a half, a bloke gets in the cab with his wife and he says to me, south side of Wandsworth Bridge, please, driver. And I looked in the, I looked in the mirror and I said, is your name Mark? And he went, yeah, how do you know that? I said, well, I'm the cab driver that took you home when you had no uh, cash or card. And his wife said to me, he talks about you when he's in the pub. <laughs> so... That's what I quite like that. Um, now I'm going to tell you a story which one or two people don't believe. Um, I stop for a couple, and um, the, only the lady gets in, and um, she's had a few drinks. It's quite obvious, and she's talking to me like she's been one of my mates for years and years and years. So I looked in the mirror and I said, to her, "Hold on a minute, are you?" Sybil Shepherd, and she went, no, you English, you're doing that to us, I'm Kathleen Turner, <clears throat> so I, I was awfully apologetic, I said, I'm sorry, Kath, and uh, she said, that's all right, you and the English, you English, you'll do that to me and um, Sybil, so another cabbie's just pulled up next to me, um, so um, when she got out, She's came to the window to pay me and um, shook me hand, didn't let go of my hand, pulled me forward and gave me a kiss on the cheek, which I can't prove. Um, and last of all, uh, quite a few years now, because the chap I'm going to talk about died a little while ago. Uh, a little fella walked past the, the near side, and I f went to myself, God, he's only small, isn't he? And he's jumped in, and I thought to myself, he needs a few cushions to sit on. And when I looked and scrutinised him, I said, blimey, are you mad Frankie Fraser? And he went, yes, yeah, son, yes, I am. I said to him, do I, do I need to call you Mr. Fraser or Frank? And, um... He went, you, you can call me mad if you want, son. <laughs> so, so I said I'd stick with Mr. Fraser, and he started laughing. 
he was great company. And um, he told me a story. He said that he was never, ever going to forgive Adolf Hitler for surrendering because he was making so much money during World War II. <laughs> he was brilliant company. I'll see you all again soon.